hello <clears throat> welcome to this video chest tempo again i'm doing a couple of tactics exercises starting here yeah will be tough i really did well in the last couple of ones oh, what is doing now okay um i really did well in the last couple of ones and this means i will get um difficult problems okay we have um black to move here and white's last move was we can look at this right here he took on took on d1 which seems kind of weird that this would be a puzzle <laughs> i mean rook takes d1 uh, <laughs> is kind of the most normal move ever hmm. that's really curious why why is this a puzzle i mean okay maybe the next move this is this, this i understand but uh, or is there something that i really don't understand here <laughs> i don't get it so i'm taking it's a bit weird why didn't they start with this here i mean rook takes d1 is very obvious um anyway what about this okay white is threatening not much he's threatening a check on f8 maybe but even then king h5 wouldn't be made i mean okay he can take the bishop but we are avoiding mates in terms of um active moves i mean queen c3 is a pretty obvious choice intending queen f3 and made to come if queen c3 queen f8 check and also bishop g7 and he won't be able to cover f3 yeah queen c3 looks very very logical really what can he do to prevent the mate rook e3 looks like an option then queen a1 threatening rook g1 check then rook h1 queen g1 mate hmm I doubt that he can defend that, really. If he does something like f4, rook g1 check, king f2, this even, bishop d4, yes. Hmm. Yeah, queen c3 looks very normal. I just wonder if there's some trickery because those the problems are notoriously tricky. Yeah, why is queen c3 a move to recognize it does a couple of things yeah it also covers the bishop on f6 i cannot paint here unfortunately <laughs> it covers the bishop and um it sets this uh, this threat here on f3 so in this kind of situation you sometimes just look for okay what would be nice and you spot okay i have the queen i could check on f3 would be great so queen c3 is a natural candidate move um let's check though queen c3 rook e3 Queen a1, he cannot block the first rank. King moves don't help, pawn moves don't help either. I don't see it. It is wrong, I don't believe it. Queen c3 is the most natural move ever. Why is this wrong? <laughs> yeah, this is Chef's tempo for you. Queen a3 is better. Why is queen c3 wrong? Huh? not even mentioned this move why is this wrong tell me I don't get it there are a couple of comments He's got rook takes e4. Wow. Ah, I see, I see, I see. He 
Yeah, this this is the this is the this is the move. I don't I don't still don't believe it. What is this? So we check on G1. He does what? Uh, he can escape, yeah. Nah, he can really escape this. And now it's check on e4. That's not working. Wait, wait, wait. King here. So this must be the the issue. If I take now, what what exactly is the issue? This is the problem. Unbelievable. Huh? Yeah, and yeah, you can easily lose here. So this check, and now you don't have a decent check. You only have this one, and then this is this is working amazing. Yeah, yeah, and it, yeah. I should have thought a little bit longer. Maybe it's never that easy. Really, never. I almost never. Okay, next one. Costly. That cost twenty points. <laughs> ah, okay. So again, we we've got black here in this position. Very wild position. So black has an extra piece, but well, white has just one pawn, but he's got play against the white open king. Knight f five is. Is one particular problem. Okay. Mm. It's knight f five. Okay. One obvious candidate move is uh, knight takes d two check. This is something to look at first knight takes to d2 check do we have other candidates i mean just just doing the trying to do it right do we have other candidate moves hmm. i don't see a particularly thrilling one even though of course we are material up so it's not like um, well, rook f4 maybe. Rook f4, yeah, that, that does make quite some sense. After rook f4, knight f5, we might even play king f6. Mm. Nah, knight takes d6 is, is, is good for white. Okay, that's not working. Look at four knight f five. I would need to take on f five, and that doesn't make. Oh wait, this, this that does make some sense. If I take it, g f ninety two check. Uh, but then you can go king a one. Hmm. Now that that is fairly interesting. That's still fairly interesting. That also means that knight f5 is probably not such a huge threat. Even though knight f5, rook f5, queen f5, knight d2, rook d2, queen d2, queen d7, no, queen d7 check is no check. Huh, okay. Knight f5 is not a real threat then. That is that is good to know. Um Okay, anyway, knight takes d2 is the number one candidate here. Knight d2, let's, let's start with the, the rook capture, queen d2, threatens mate on b2. Queen e5. Queen e5, some rook to f6. Hmm. Uh, anything better there? I mean, thankfully we are threatening mate on v2. Hmm. 
let's say rook g to f6 knight f5 check knight f5 check hmm king f7 queen G, queen c7 that's no good hmm knight f5 king g6 knight h4 check knight h4 check king f7 this is actually working but uh, he has rook h6 as well mm, yeah. wow okay And that queen takes e5 move, that is really an issue. It takes everything, queen takes e5. Can I, if king f7, there's rook f1. This is, this is immediately. Uh, immediately a problem. I can also, if I play rook one, uh, rook eight f6 then, again knight f6 check. Uh, by the way, I just I just saw uh, another candidate move. Sometimes you take a while. Queen takes d2 is also a candidate. And that's it was sloppy. Queen takes d2. I could have seen quicker. It has a huge advantage uh, <laughs> to knight takes d2. Black uh, white cannot take on uh, e5. That's a very interesting move, actually. White doesn't have any meaningful checks. He only has knight f5, which I can just take. And I'm threatening mate. Okay. So queen, d queen takes d2. What what can he do? What is it, what can he play? What, what is actually possible? Knight c2 maybe attacking the bishop on a3. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> wow. Okay, queen d2, knight c2. Don't even see. Wow. What, what are we playing then? Amazing. The bishop is also hanging. Queen takes d1, rook d1, knight d2, check, rook d2, rook f1, check, there's knight e1, unfortunately. Otherwise, that would be very nice. But the um, back rank is weakish. Maybe this is something that we can use. Something like, I mean, queen d2, knight c2, and then a knight c2, rook d8, maybe. And then he can take the knight on f3. Rook d6, there's a check on h7. Rook, rook h6 is a move, maybe. Wow, well, this is totally crazy. If this is a solution, that, that would be utterly crazy. Queen d2, knight f2, rook h6. Yeah, I do. This is the kind of thing when you see it, you don't dare enter it because you kind of know that it's wrong. But queen d2. So knight, knight d2 ran into problems because of rook d2, queen d2, queen e5. Okay. There was this rook f4 move, which I haven't not which I have not really refuted yet. I mean I didn't look at it that much. 
And there's queen takes d2, which is, I mean, looking very nice and therefore, <laughs> therefore gets, gets considered somehow. Um, queen takes g6 then is nuts, doesn't work at all. Queen d2, knight c2, rook h6, this is what I'm thinking. That's really crazy. But what does he have? He cannot take on h6 as queen d1 mate. What happens if he takes the bishop, by the way? If he takes the bishop on a3? Hmm, this is the real issue. Somehow I feel like I'm overlooking something. Queen. I mean, what what you can do maybe is no queen d two, knight c two, queen c three. There's also the check on d seven, which seems very irritating. Yeah. Yeah, and. Rightly so, that is irritating. Hmm. So I'm not getting don't, don't really get get far here. After queen d2, knight c2, I mean I can just move the bishop, actually. Maybe this is the real problem. Yeah, why not? If I just move the bishop from a3, yeah, sure. Stupid. Yeah, I can just move the bishop, maybe to d6, blocking the d file. The knight on c2 is not doing anything. He has no check on f5 and he has no check in general. He still cannot take on d2. Maybe, maybe this is really the, the solution. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, let's check that again. I know I, I didn't really look at rook f4, so it's not the purest form of candidates ever but anyway queen takes d2 yeah rook d2 is easy i'm threatening mate on b2 he doesn't have any meaningful check knight f5 i'm just taking yeah it really there's really only knight c2 after which my bishop is hanging on a3 i tried the fancy stuff but he would always take my bishop. So what if I remove the bishop? Let's say <clears throat> to d6 blocks the d file. So next move, I can actually move the queen. <clears throat> so knight c2, then bishop d6. He doesn't have a check. That is a good thing. I mean, okay, rook h7 or whatever, but nothing really scary. If he goes like rook f1 or something i play queen f4 okay come on i make i'm doing this move now if it's wrong it's wrong it is wrong <laughs> uh, wow it is wrong uh, okay i don't really know why why is it wrong i don't get it so i knight takes d2 this win yeah okay i mean i i i, I had this i was thinking I, was, I just thought, okay, that looks kind of tricky. I mean, this is a very obvious line. The thing is that here I wasn't sure if I can avoid the perpetual. Like here, knight f5 was a move that seemed tricky to me. Isn't That is not mentioned here in the notes for whatever reason. That was the only move that worried me much. How do I, how do I play now? Mm, ah, I can go. No, I cannot. I can go here actually, probably because rook h6 I can maybe take. Hmm. That was what that that irritated me a lot. Hmm. F5. 
I mean, I cannot take it. And if I go here, this is probably really not good. King e8 is made. King e6 also looks utterly wrong. This is queen g7 made. I mean, what what exactly was? Why don't they give this line? This is kind of crazy. Or is is knight f5 so ridiculous? I, I mean, this is this was my my problem move. Let's check at the comments. Yeah. I mean, this is computer checked, so they are right. They are right. It's not like I'm doubting that. Okay, why is my thing exactly not working? Uh, queen takes d2. So, queen takes d2. Knight c2. Um, okay, now I was thinking bishop d6. And ah, okay, it's probably this move. Intending knight f5 again. Okay, let's say I take this. Uh, it seems entirely unclear, huh? I just lost 30 points due to that. <laughs> Unbelievable. Uh, yeah, knight f5 is the only move. And now, yeah, probably, phew, do I have to take it? Ah, it's very tough. Okay, I, I see the problems. I didn't see knight e3. Okay, let's do the next one. Wow. Oh. And again, again, such a defensive problem. Those are the trickiest ones. It's much easier if you have something where you can, I don't know, give a couple of checks and mate the guy. Yeah, then here, yeah, where you just see, okay, you will go bishop c3 and probably checkmate me. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, um, so what is this now? What what did he take there actually? A knight, okay. Oh, so, so he's got one pawn. He's got one extra pawn. And rook takes f5. So do I have, I mean, if I take, if I take the rook, that's the first move to check. If I take the rook, The issue is bishop c3, threatening mate on h8. And I cannot escape with the king. There's queen h8, check king e7, queen f6, check king e8, queen f7, mate. So after bishop c3, it's very serious. I actually only have bishop e3 check to stop that. Queen takes e3. And then rook takes c4. Hmm. Then it's got e7 though. That's annoying, very annoying. Hmm. e7 check, king, uh, queen e8. Check on e6. Uh. Mm, not good. So g takes bishop c3, bishop e3 check, queen takes rook c4, e7. And it's not, I don't really have a move, right? Um, E7 
seven. Threatening to take the queen and e eight. And the rook is on c4, so I cannot really go queen d7 or so he will promote. <sighs> mm. Yeah, I, I guess that's not working. It really is not working. I cannot take that damn rook. <laughs> Amazing. What else can I do? I can try to take on c4, rook c4. Um, rook c4, queen c4, gf5. <sighs> Not easy. Queen c6, maybe. Very, very difficult. Okay. Um, Let's rook c4 is a candidate, but it's still complicated. What about bishop g7? This was actually my, my initial first move that I was thinking of. Yeah, attacking the queen with a tempo and then take the rook. Isn't that simple? I mean, why isn't that working? Can he. Nah. He cannot sacrifice the queen, huh? Would be very, very weird. No, cannot do that. Rook f7, check king g8. It's not working. Not ever. <laughs> I just now state that it. Uh, it uh, nah, I don't believe it. It's not working. So he has to move the queen probably. And then I take the rook. What is the problem? The e pawn again or e7 as queen d7? I don't get it. Again, I don't get it. Bishop g7, what is the problem? Would have been. I mean, it, I really don't see anything at all for white. Anything at all. So take this now, or is there still some trick? I mean, rook takes c4 is is a move. It's not totally idiotic to consider. But well, there's no reason not to take this. Ah, thankfully I got some points there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so the the key thing was that this immediately is not working. Let's see, they certainly have some lines there. Um, no, they don't even don't even show that. Why? They should show it at least. <laughs> yeah, Bishop C three is the problem. Threatening. I cannot draw. I want to draw arrow. King H eight. Uh, Queen H eight made. I only have that. And now e7, and this is a huge problem. That's e8, sorry, e8 threatened, and the capture threatened. So if you block this, there's this, and now it's it's really bad. The bishop is blocking g7, h8, I only have this, and this is mate. Yeah, even with the rook, it's mate. <laughs> yeah, so that was nice. Okay, let's do one more. Or at least, at last, something with an attack. <laughs> okay, um, that that really looks like some mating ideas going on. Queen e8 mate, some mate there with the knight and rook would be cool. Rook d8 check, bishop takes, queen b4 check. That's not leading anywhere, presumably. Anyway, no, let's not. Let's not. Let's uh, let's check first what kind of candidates we have. Some. Oh, 
First of all, what kind of material is that? We have a piece up here, right? Why there's a piece up? But G2 is of course quite <sighs> quite under fire. The A7 rook is undefended, H8 rook is undefended. F6 is hanging. Really a totally irritating position. Um, okay. I have no simple way to to keep the peace. At least I don't don't see it. Hmm. I wonder if there's some kind of mating idea. Hmm. I have some idea. I don't know if it is doing much good, but knight knight c5 is that a move somehow? <laughs> knight c5 huh? threatens knight c d7 checkmate. And if he takes with the bishop, I have rook d8 check, king e7, and we go from there. Like rook d7, king f8, knight h7 check, something like this. It could could work, but white is totally pinned with everything. So, And after knight c5, there's also um, the simple move um, g takes f6, after which I'm not totally sure <laughs> what my response is. Uh. Hmm. That's mad. G takes F. That's really, really a nuisance there. Can I do something about that? I have ninety seven check, but don't really see what this is doing. Hmm. Other possible candidate moves are something like queen d4, so but I really wonder, I mean, if he takes on f3 with the bishop, he's not threatening a mate immediately. That's really an issue here. Uh, my own king is quite, quite under pressure. I wonder, I mean, something like queen b4 is an interesting move. Threatening rook d8 mate. Bishop takes b4, rook d8 check, king e7. Rook d7 is, is, a, is a draw, at least. Is a draw. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but... <laughs> Can we? I mean, probably he really, he probably has to has to force that draw. But I wonder. Of course, can we win here? I mean, we are a piece up at the moment, but we have multiple things hanging. Crazy position, really. Um, An interesting move is also knight d4. Knight d4, intending maybe knight takes e6 and then for discovery. But I don't see what I'm doing after g takes, if he just takes my, my, my knight. This is really the problem. If he takes that knight, my most dangerous attacking piece is gone.
Yeah, and queen d4 is a move that I wonder about. Attacking the rook. But maybe he can just go rook a8 and then take on g2 next. Maybe. Ah, very, very irritating position. I mean, queen b4, I think, is a draw. <laughs> Might be a draw. G takes f, rook d8, check, king g7, queen e7. That must be okay. I will take f6 as well. But queen b4, bishop takes, rook d8, check, king e7. There is no alternative. Wait, there's rook takes h8, threatening rook e8 mate, and uh, man, that's, that's, that's totally nonsense. It's not going to work. But we have a draw. Hmm. Wow. Early in the morning, knight e4. I mean, if I just move that knight away there from, but where? Uh, knight d7, king d8, queen d4. I, I don't. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. I'm just totally irritated. Rook d7 for rook takes e7. Hmm. That's, that's interesting actually. Rook d7, bishop g2, rook a7 is probably okay. He doesn't have any great uh, discover check. At least I don't see one. Rook d7, g takes f6, and then rook e7, king e7, check, yeah, it might work. Uh, rook d7, g, f, rook e7, king e7, queen b4, check. King e8, just gf6, and then he's got rook bishop g2. Hmm. No, I don't believe that works. So I think that queen b4 is a draw. <laughs> but I don't see anything better, really. Rook d7, gf, or do we have something better? Rook e7, then king e7. Ah, okay, I can take on f6 with check, of course. Uh, that's much, much stronger, of course. Take there with check is much stronger. Hmm, that's interesting. Now that, that works, actually. So is it rook d7 after all? Rook d7 again, let's check. Bishop f6, e f6. Now that threatens rook d8 mate. That that cannot work for black. Um, okay, I'm doing rook d7 now, but this is like if it works, it's great. If not. Wow, I was right, <laughs> but I, I couldn't. I, I couldn't really calculate it till the end. Um, okay, here I was. I was originally thinking just rook takes a seven because I didn't see a great discover check. I just wonder if there's something, something better. Um, yeah, 
it's very difficult to it's very difficult to play some um, some slow move now in this position as he threatens the discoveries I mean a move like I know queen d4 or whatever this, this is not going to work if I take the rook let's just think about this I'll take the rook then I'm a rook up for the moment but I'm not threatening much Is there something better? Cannot move the king or anything. He really has just one check if he if he does the discover discovery with the bishop. I just think if I take a seven gf what about this i don't have rook a8 he can take that with the bishop with check this is what irritates me a little bit maybe just e takes f6 actually he doesn't have a great square for that bishop yeah b4 is with check c5 is protected d6 is protected and bishop d8 is queen d6. And there's just always just one check with that bishop and I go to f1. Okay, so I can take the rook. Ah, oh, Jesus. I got that one right at least. <laughs> uh, wow, 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 wow. That's from a game Georg Meyer versus Ivan Shiparinov. Yeah, so Meyer found that, great. I think I actually saw that position. It it looked somewhat familiar, but I couldn't really couldn't really piece it together. Is queen before a draw? This this is what would, would interest me. <laughs> Slight advantage to black here. <laughs> Depth thirteen. I know what this exactly means. This is imply that it wouldn't be very deep. Queen before g f e f queen f six. Checks g f. I was thinking rook d8 here. Why isn't rook d8 working? I thought that this would work. Uh, why is this not good? There is no check and I thought this e takes f6 threat would be would be dangerous. Is he doing this? Wow, what what a crazy position. Okay, let's look at briefly here. He took he um, rook d7, he took took on d2, yeah. Yeah, that, that's the only really serious move. And then we had so we then we had this right rook, rook a7 and here black is, is out of out of checks. Gf there's ef. This is important, yeah. That after this the sorry, <laughs> the bishop has no square. It can go nowhere. C5 is taken. B4 is taken with check. D6 is taken. Bishop D8. There's queen D6 check. Wow, that was tough. Whew. Okay, so I did. What did I do in this um, set? I think I got two or three right and two two were wrong, right? So my 50-50 or something. Yeah, I'm okay with that. They are really really difficult. And uh, as I said, it's early in the morning. <laughs> okay, well, thanks for watching.